So this what it sounded like to me is that men are uh, becoming desperate. Desperate. No, they're, they're desperate. Men they're, are becoming they're, desperate. They're, desperate. They're becoming victims, and women are becoming the ones that are preying on men. What goes on in the clubs is what I what I see is like women going towards men with the money, blah blah blah, and then what women, a lot of girls do after they've done whatever they phone their friends oh yeah you know what yeah did they took me to the hotel and so and so and so and so and yeah he's got money you know what i'm gonna do yeah yeah, i'm gonna get him to go out with me next week and, and spend money blah, blah. and it's like wrong, so he's not wrong <laughs> not, not at one wrong. point You're right fraud, but you was right as well though you was right as well where they, there's guys who think oh you guys ain't got good self-esteem if i wear the drip the girls are gonna i'm gonna chat yeah, the girl i want and, and they'll the have one. no money at all like you can wear like what Gucci head to toe, like LV head to toe, and then all of a sudden girls are gonna think, oh my god, like you have a trim and you're wearing designer. Oh my god, he's got yeah, the most money true. because he's wearing LV shoes, LV shirt. Like, do you know what I mean? It's insane. And then you have no money. You actually have no money but because you look like you have money. Girls automatically think, okay, cool, he's the gold mine. And they're gonna try and take advantage of him. Yeah. yeah. Have, you, like, have you ever done that? No. <laughs> no. I have my own money. And the green was nice. Do you lot. know? Do you want? Do you know any girls that have done that? Yeah. Do your friends do that? Some, I'll be real. But you don't do it. But no. have you? Ever, isn't that? Is, you know what, isn't I, that I, convenient? Do you know what? I want to ask a question. Have you ever questioned the mentality? <laughs> why they do that? Why are they doing that? Because you know that it's nothing meaningful. I feel like when girls go out, yeah, like cool, you're paying for your cab to where, whatever location you're going, and it's like when you get there, it's just like because. You can go out of like a group of your friends, but like let's say five of you have no money, and then four of you do have money. If that makes sense. Mm. So like. The, of the five that have no money have to find a way to stay at home. Is that about the same? I'm not forcing you. Should women, say <laughs> women can leave their house yeah. with no in money and come back with money it's and true. come back with money. Someone else's and money. Yeah, that's Dude, true. It's actually the reality of the society we live in now. Like that's actually the truth of like how some women actually portray themselves. Like false lifestyle, the, man. It's yeah, like, like mm-hmm. lifestyle. That's what they believe that lifestyle will get you somewhere. But it really isn't. That is egregious behavior. So, so as a woman, what do you think? Because you know your friends have done it. What do you think that these guys are actually looking for? Pussy. Right. Yeah. And what are the girls looking for? Like, what are the girls looking for? Simp. What are the girls looking for? <laughs> a simp. A simp. <laughs> be honest. Be no, honest. No, what, are, like, what are the girls looking for? It's a simp. Oh, I feel what? like they're looking for. Um, first of all. To get lit that night, and they're looking for someone that they can use and abuse in the future. Not use and abuse, but like, okay, cool. Like, if this Easy guy nice. pays for my night and it's just like he made me and my friends feel comfortable, I take his number. Then, like, next week, on a time that I want to go out, he's got us basically. Do you mm. know what I mean? Do you think those women have multiplied? As in, yes, As in, they do, have. Do, do, they there's, have. There's more of those women out there. Yeah, Especially the for the women that part. don't like have 100%. a job or they don't have anything going for yeah. themselves they actively do that on the weekends they've got numbers you think there's not uncle one two three four five uh, six yeah at least back in the that day it was uncle it. it was actually uncle that was doing it mm-hmm. now it's nice like, yeah it's like, we're yeah, getting down yeah. to the nitty-gritty now yeah. <laughs> you know like you, you're not gonna really go out with an uncle to a club are you depends. i mean depends, depends but like if you want to be involved in the life like the lifestyle era like you're gonna find someone that you find a chat like no it, it's true because i think my experience as an event promoter um event corner skewed my relationship with females i i don't think that what you like now no it, it does it's skewed it's skewed it's skewed in the sense that rod are they all females all heifers or they're all again when you say heifers what do you mean as you're, in... you're just doing things you, you're willing to to sell yourself sell yourself for what you believe is a positive gain for yourself mm, and you mean... don't have any feelings of your actions you're doing because mm-hmm. I get what I get. Yeah, it's not like you're doing it because out of pleasure, you're doing it because you know that you're going to get something from Very it. Very transactional. So yeah. it's like, how can, how can, how can you dis, 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 uh, compartmentalize that aspect? You're going to go through a real experience and you're going to remove your feeling off it because of what you're going to get out or what you think you're going to get out of it. Yeah. And I think, honestly, after one year, two years, five years of doing that, don't think every single guy is going to hit. 
Like, it's, it's it, oh, I did this and like, it went through. Would, would you see, like, the same girls come back over and over again to do the same thing to I try and get, a, like, a new victim? You stop this behaviour at 21. By 26, yeah, you're going to have a lot of losses outside a lot of wins. Yeah, you're going to have very high wins. Yeah, Novikov. Yeah, you went Novikov. You got that on your Insta. Well done. But what about all the times <laughs> where the time. guy, the guy didn't caught on to it because guys are smart i, I saw I, I was getting caught no, up to smart. This. i feel like guys now right. know like what girls are on <laughs> like they're, they're actually, they actually i mean they we entertain it as in we, we're mm -hmm. not smart we're not really gonna because we, now we, it's just yeah, like yeah sorry sorry we entertain it yeah we entertain it still we entertain it why well, i don't i don't like this i don't, I'm not I don't like this. Like, oh, what do you mean guys are not smart and you're you're you're, you're laughing like guys yeah, are dumb there are some that have the hope hang on let me hear her speak now let me hear this there, there are some that are like, oh, you know what? I'm just going to like, because I've got the male friends who be like, yeah, so and so. I'm like, right, yeah. you did that. I'm like, right, you did that. You know, she's like, probably doing that with somebody like someone else. So you're just one of many on the list. And unfortunately, we are living a time with cost of living crisis. Some people don't have jobs and they literally are actively, I know people who are actively using, doing this yeah. every weekend. Just using know. guys. Yeah. And getting the perks of it. And there are guys that are just willing to give their money and their time. And for some of them, they, maybe they don't. And a lot of these guys, let's be real, they are like on the road. They don't really have time. So that one moment yeah, with I'll, so and so is that, oh, mm, she's mm. giving me her attention or whatever, mm. holds 500 pounds. And then she's going to come and do that next week and she's going to invite her friends. And then her friend's going to meet your friend. And now we're all going out together. Yeah, like, it's this, like this, 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 every this, friend has a friend. Or so something. do you believe yeah, it's an intrinsic self-esteem issue for those guys who live most of their lives on the road where they don't have that interaction with favourable, they don't have favourable interactions. No, only like, one aspect. That's yeah, one but aspect. I feel like with men as well. Like, all the hard workers who actually are high-level earners, but because they But they're, sometimes they're they just want to chill with girls. Because I'll be because honest, like, if you work a highly technical field, in any discipline, yeah, it's mainly going to be dominated by a, a certain sex in the tech field. If you do engineering, you're just going to be in the office, just men. And the only females you may see are secretary, yeah. cleaning staff, or, or middle management in terms of HR. But then if you look at the ratio between men and fe females, if just one hot chick in HR, do you think you're the only guy that clocked that hot chick in HR? <laughs> <laughs> everyone did and if you're just a normal worker and you've got um, deputy manager this manager VP executive who do you think she's looking at yeah. so the one so so, month, so so this what it sounded like to me is that men are uh, becoming desperate like, Desperate, no, they're, they're desperate. men are becoming they're, desperate. They're, desperate they're becoming victims and women are becoming the ones that are preying on men not yes. necessarily well that's what it sounds like no, no, guys not, are, 